still better than yesterday, but still. What's that? It helps. I don't mind it picking up. Oh! I got him. He crushed it. <laughs> what is going on everyone welcome back to another video uh so this is actually the last video of july uh most people will probably watch this in august because tuesday is actually the last day of july um but july has been like the best month in, basically since the musky video came out um last i knew the channel for the month was approaching like 4500 channel views which is a crazy number normally we end up in like the 15 to 2000 range um but yeah so this week uh we're going to the same spot as last week uh we went to two other spots yesterday and a spot during the week no fish at all so i just really want to catch a fish because it feels like it's been forever um so as i said guys uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. 1,000 subscribers is the goal. And as I said, guys, we're gonna get to the fishing and see what we can catch. Alrighty, guys, here we are uh, fishing here again. Gonna see if we can't uh, find some catfish today. We finally found one yesterday, so. Very calm morning out here on the lake, so I'm going to put one over here. There we go. And then on our end, got the whopper blobber. Gotta watch out for these seagulls though. Big cast right over there. See if we can find some big bass. A lot of seagulls flying around today. Oh, we already seen more surface activity today than we did yesterday. Already seen what? More surface activity today than we did yesterday. Yeah. Oh my God! What a baby. <laughs> there we go guys skunks off the board oh great that drop shot it's got one yeah it's a good one too start get the net There we go, guys. Caught a fish on a drop shot. Oh! Oh! Air time. Net's not extended. Oh my god. He's going to be bigger than that. Well, I thought he was. Choked down the drop shot. There we go, guys. I don't even know how he did that. Choked it down. He's got himself hooked twice here. There we go. There we go, guys. First bass of the day. Really wanted that drop shot. Get him back. He's gonna. He gone. Alrighty, guys. So this is all we were doing. We were drop shot in this white shad. Um. This thing catches everything, smallmouth, largemouth, all types of crap you haven't caught on it before. I've caught pike on this thing before, but it's got some crazy action. That's why I like using them. Let's get back out there, see if we find another one. A little finesse fishing today. Hopefully we can find a big one. That one felt real big, but... I don't know if I want the small plopper, what do I want to do? I can't find the spook. No? But I have a popper. Anything. <sighs> Might get lucky, you never know. 
I try popper, see how far I can cast it. If I can't cast it far enough, we'll go into the plopper. Oh! Oh no! He hit it as soon as it hit the water! No, no, he was that way more. Oh, jeez, they're waking up. Oh, he's on. He hit it as soon as he hit the water, guys. <laughs> yeah, that'd probably be a good idea. Huh. He wanted it. He really, really wanted it. Oh, wow. He's right here. Uh oh. Beautiful color. Small. There we go. Small, is it jumping here? Change that way. That one jumped twice. By pulling that out. Actually, that hook just came off, but. He's already off. He's won't open his mouth now. There we go, guys. Got on one. He hit it twice. Kind of panicked the first time he jumped for it. Not very big, but. Oh. Hopefully, there's a bunch more out there. Great. Yep. Thanks. All right, let's get it back. He gone. Alrighty guys, let me show you what I was using real quick. I've like never used one on the channel before. This little black, gray, and red um, popper. But both times now, he just hit it as soon as it hit the water. See, there's another one out there. his waves picked up yeah I know I mean still better than yesterday but still what's that if it helps I don't mind it picking up oh, oh got I got him he crushed it he, he obliterated that one guys this is a good one this is a strong fish oh my god holy cow guys Biggin! Oh my! Haven't seen him yet. I want to land this one though. Get out of the rocks. Oh, it's a big smallmouth. Yeah. Oh no! Oh no! 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 Oh, he's off! He's off! He's off! Dude, get out of there! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> so that was so crazy. Oh my gosh. Bang. There we go, guys. Strong fish. Very unhappy one. Yeah, this is a chance here. There we go. Football. Crush the plopper. Tried to break me off in those pylons. I don't know if you guys can see them on the camera. They're just under the water. He actually got wrapped around them at one point. There we go. A couple pounds. I wonder if that's the one that's been jumping around out there. But we're going to get him back. See if we can get some more. Nah, we'll let that one go. Next time. Alrighty, guys. So, that, ba that bass was way out there. You guys saw the blow up. I didn't. So let's see if we can get some more. They're out there. It's got to cause enough of a racket for them. Alrighty, guys. Gonna give it a shot over here. Got the popper. 
Now watch out for birds though. That's one. Yeah, that's a fish. There we go, guys. Little guy. I got him. Found him. There we go, guys. Little guy. One of the Senko. There we go. A little large mouth. Fought real good, though. He gone. Alrighty guys, Let's see if we can find a couple more before uh, call it a day here. Right over here. Oh, that's a hit. That's a fish, oh my God. That's a good one, guys. That's bigger than that last one, that's for sure. Oh my God, he smoked it. It as soon as it hit the water. That was crazy. I saw the line going just like tight. Come here. Come here. There we go. Getting bigger. Biggest of the day. There we go, guys. Probably pound and a half. Pound. Oh, that's pretty chunky. He gone. I don't know if this Senko's got much left in it. This thing is getting pretty beat up. That's another one. That's another good one. That's a good one, guys. He's gonna jump. Oh, it was a pike. Oh. Yeah, he just broke me off. I saw his head. That was a good, that was a thick one. It looked pretty thick. Except for he took my Senko. That time we found a pike though. It's been a while. Alrighty guys. Came up, grabbed a new hook, grabbed a new Sanko. Of course, pike were hanging out, causing all types of problems. Bit that would clean off. That's a fish. Yep. A little one though. Probably that one that was just jumping as I said. Uh, I'm gonna need you to net it. There we go. Back up. Yeah, I need you to back up. <laughs> All right. I basically got to climb in the net with him. Land him. There we go, guys. Another solid one. Another pound and a half. It's about the size of that one I caught it. Pretty long. Wow, he's barely hooked. I mean, it was all the way in there. Choked that one, guys. There we go, guys. There's another one. Again, not a giant, but we're starting to find him. After, uh... The only fish that were around there for a minute were some smallmouth. Let's get him back. Back in over here. He gone.
Alrighty guys, quick check in. Last three fish have all been Sankos. Use this a lot this time of year, especially here seems to work. Just a hook with a wacky rig Sanko. I don't bother with rubber bands or anything like that. And it seems to work, so let's get this back out there. See if we can't land a couple more before we call it a morning. The sun is coming up. Got one? At least you finally got the one that's been in that corner. Yep, I'm grabbing that. Well, I guess it ended the day off for the, on a high note. <laughs> Yeah, they've been really clean this today. There was that one earlier that had some red on them, but oh, okay, okay. there we go, guys. Final fish of the day, last cast of the day, too. Good last cast right there. He's gone. All right, that's gonna do it for this week's video, guys. Uh, started kind of slow. Uh, those smallmouth then started to jump. We landed a couple, lost a couple more. Uh, then we added three largemouth bass to end it, uh, lost the pike, so that kind of sucked, um, but it was definitely a good sized pike. That rod makes every fish feel like a giant. It is pretty fun to catch fish on it, uh, but with a Senko wacky rigged like that, that pike was obviously going to bite through it. No problems there, um, so we'll get him next time, but uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. 1,000 subscribers is the goal. And as I said, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys next week.